Well, first of all, what I'm going to do is decide what voice I'm going to use, whether it's my outside vo voice or my inside voice. And I'm going to put myself on a timer because I, I've been known to talk too much. So here we go. Not that my friend did, but I do, and I admit it. First of all, good afternoon, everyone. What I'd like to do is to acknowledge that we're here as guests on the Treaty, Treaty 7 territory, the friend of my, uh, land of my good friend, Mr. Makinima, and the homeland of the Métis people of Alberta. My name is Lee Tom, and I'm from the Kikino Métis Settlement. And I'm proud to be here today on behalf of the eight land-based Métis Settlements of Alberta and the two, two credible assertions of Alberta in uh, Fort Mackay and Lake San Lake St. Anne Métis. <coughs> Sorry, breathe. First of all, what I want to say, it's been a long road here, and I'm so proud to be here today, and I'm just saying wow as I look at the landscape of this beautiful land, and I look at the faces in this crowd, and I start to get comfortable in my speaking, and the passion's going to spill out in three ways. And I'm honored, I'm humbled, and I'm proud to be here as a Métis man on behalf of the people of the Métis Settlements of Alberta. And I really appreciate the time to speak here. And I'll go right into my speech. I'm honored and humbled to be here today in front of you all to recognize and celebrate the path forward to true economic reconciliation. As we walk as Western Canadians together in British Columbia, Alberta, and Saskatchewan, hand in hand, on a true path to economic re reconciliation. United, we have come to a, a place where we created a partnership that not only prioritizes our needs in our Indigenous communities, but builds long-lasting investments into our communities that will extend generations be far beyond mine and yours. Long-lasting generations to come. I'm proud to be here on this Treaty 7 territory as a guest, as one nation, a First Nation, Métis Provincial Government, and the energy sector in TC. This monumental partnership empowers us as Indigenous people to invest into our communities and secure commitment that our voices are shared as we shape this Western Canadian resource landscape it's a truly proud day for me, and I'll go into a few thank yous. And if, if I forget you, please, I apologize. We'll talk about it after. So I want to thank, first of all, the Indigenous Consortium. The Indigenous Consortium that sat for five months and worked countless hours. I'll get past the names and recognize Treaty 6, Treaty 7, Treaty 8, the eight Métis Settlements, Alberta, and the two credible assertion communities. My timer. Sorry, you can edit that out. I just need 30 seconds. I also want to thank, of course, Madam Premier. We've met before a few times. I seem to be following you around, and I always end up beside you somewhere and then doing a jig. I got it on video, by the way. You can edit that out, too. But AIOC, Shanna, some of the work you've done in your, in your group, and, of course, uh, BLG. I, I don't know if they're here today, but without good lawyers and good TD advisors, things like this aren't possible. And of course, the TC Energy team, IR, corporate, everybody in this room who's proud today in this beautiful landscape you have, we can stand here together united as First Nations, Métis, industry, and we can stand on one path. And I'm so proud. And of course, Excellus, the group that kept us in line the group that kept us updated. And of course, my last thank you to my Métis Settlements General Council communities and the eight settlements of Alberta that put their faith in me to negotiate on behalf of our landscape and our lands in Alberta. Thank you very much. I stand here humbled and proud. It takes a dedicated, passionate team to negotiate this big of a deal. And I truly am honored to be part of this positive generational impact that will have Indigenous people for many years to come. And beneficial, beneficial ownership is the only way. And it's the new way. We are united today, and we are united moving forward. Thank you, and I humbly thank you everyone for having me.